In this video, the goal is going to be to use a compass and straight edge to copy line segment AB. So the first thing we want to do is we're going to use a straight edge to construct a reference line such that the reference line is definitely longer than line segment AB. And it's fairly obvious that this line that we've built right here or this ray that we've built is longer than line segment AB. So we can, at this step, just label this endpoint. We'll call it point C. So now what we want to do next is we're going to set our compass on the endpoint A. And we're going to extend the length of the compass so that the pencil end reaches point B. And now at this stage, we've set the length of the compass equal to the length of line segment AB. And to verify, we're going to sketch an arc. And we could observe that this arc intersects point B. So now what we're going to do next, we're going to set the fixed end of the compass on point C. And we're going to sketch an arc until this arc intersects our reference line. And now what we could do is we're going to label this intersection point. We'll call it point D. And now since the length of the compass was set to be equal to the length of line segment AB, we can conclude that line segment AB is congruent to line segment CD. And just to verify, because you would not be able to do this on paper, we could click and drag the original line segment and note that these two line segments line up directly. So you notice how line segment AB rests completely on top of line segment CD. Therefore, that's another way we could verify that this construction did work. OK, well, this is going to conclude this copying a line segment construction. Thank you all for watching, and I hope that this video was helpful.